Welcome everyone. Hope y'all had a good week. Uh, Saturday, so let's do a vehicle. Got the slugger tank. I'm missing the gun, the hatch, and the the, the thing that used to pop out of the back here. Uh, do have the engine cover. There's the inside of it there. Uh, this was sort of unique vehicle wise because it did actually get him to go in there. You could close a hatch on him while he was in the vehicle. Most of the time they the Joes stuck out of their vehicles and <laughs> had to just sort of go with it. Like the Mobat. It's, it seemed like there was plenty of room for that but for him to go into it but no, they had him standing up there being basically a target. <laughs> but uh, this was pretty uh, much a no-frills vehicle. It's just there went my phone. It just, you know, it had, let's say, six wheels, articulated cannon to a degree. Nothing going on underneath the cannon. A little, little hydraulic detail or something in there. Uh, pretty, but I mean, there's no, you know, that and the engine hatch were the only two pieces. And, uh, of course, got the, the driver is... Uh, the driver was Thunder, this slugger and drive Thunder, yeah. <laughs> uh, a little overexposed with the uh, bright lights there, so let me zoom in a little bit there and see if that does any better on the details. Come on, <laughs> work with me. There he is. Set him down now. Okay. <laughs> a little overexposed with the light. There, a little more detail on his faces. Face. Uh, no, nothing really shaking on the back. Standard pants, just black instead of. Uh, nothing. I say nothing fancy about him. Really, just he, had, he came with a fancier helmet. It had like earmuffs and everything. But uh, otherwise. That's him. I guess I can melt since I'm zoomed in now. I can show you one more. Here is it. Looks like, looks like they used the turbine engine on there. <laughs> you can't no nothing really. You know, a couple of little panels on the inside there, but no real details beyond that. The seat cushion or whatever you want to call it there. Uh, and then. And, had the muzzle, muzzle on it there. <laughs> and yeah, and again, no real details on the bottom either. Some riveting details in 1984 Pawtucket, Rhode Island. <laughs> it did have a hook up so you could tow the other vehicles, the, the trailers and everything that they came out with. But anyways, that is the Slugger and Thunder. Thanks for watching everybody. Uh, I think I think I'm gonna go a little obscure next week. I've got I've got I got something I found a pretty much the whole set of, and I'm gonna to want to go ahead and burn through it. And it, it, it should take a whole week to do that, so that, that'll be something that that was popular for about 35 minutes in the late 80s, <laughs> maybe early 90s. I'm pretty sure it was the late 80s. But anyways, thanks for watching. If you're digging what I'm doing, make sure and subscribe. We'll catch you next time.